I wish you a very, very happy new year. Many people have made resolutions going into the new year, a new decade, a brand new opportunity ahead of us. But here's one that you have probably missed, and that is to be a joyful receiver. So many people are joyful givers, but I want you to become a joyful receiver of the gift of life and all the other gifts from God. There is a circle of joy that unites the giver and the receiver of a gift. And at times you may be more caught up in the joy of the experience of giving than receiving. So today, I ask you to renew your joy by being open to receiving. Be surprised how many times over the years I've seen the major block to someone's prosperity and opportunity and advancement in life is that they are not good receivers. Well, as an enthusiastic receiver, you accept so much more than the gift itself. You welcome the giver as well as the gift and receive the added blessings of the love and the thoughtfulness that always accompanies the gift. And you are even more open to receiving from God. Do you remember the story when a blind man asked Jesus, Lord, let me see again? This is in Luke 18, 42. Jesus said to him, Receive your sight. Your faith has saved you. The answer that Jesus gave was to encourage the man to receive. Jesus was, in effect, saying to accept this gift of healing as a gift from God. And oh, what a feeling of joy we have in accepting the gift of life and healing each day. We open ourselves to the life of God, the giver of all life. I pray in 2020 that you are a joyful receiver every time, all the time.